Hi Virgo, welcome to my third channel, my Virgo only channel. My name is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking, sharing, and subscribing. I post every day bringing you the latest updated tarot reading. In this reading, we're going to find out who's secretly holding grudges towards you right now and why. Today is the 7th of March 2024. Time here in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia is 4 38 p.m. Okay, let's get your reading started, Virgo. Spirits and angels, please show me for Virgo who is secretly holding grudges towards Virgo right now. A fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, could also be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Death at the bottom of at the bottom of the deck at the bottom of the deck. That means you have a separation between you and this person. Both of you are not together right now. Okay, there has been an ending between the two of you. But I've got a really creepy specific message. It's not for all of you. Death sometimes could literally mean death. Some someone who has passed on. Okay. Um, you may have somebody, again Virgo, don't freak out, I know it sounds creepy, but someone who has passed on may be holding certain grudges towards you. So my advice is do your cleansing um, because sometimes the, the dead, when they hold grudges towards you, they might give you, bring you bad luck. That part, just for some of you, okay Virgo? In fact, I just thought of one story here. Uh, I don't know if I should tell you. Okay, I'll tell you, but in a bit, okay? Um, a little creepy, but yeah, that was what I heard. Anyway, we've got the Page of Wands here, Mom first. You've got, besides the dead, someone who has passed on that part <laughs> for some of you, okay? I don't mean to laugh, but I know it's pretty out there, but, and it's not for all of you. Anyway, Page of Wands in reverse, Fire Sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, Knight of Cups in reverse, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. You may have two people holding grudges towards you right now. I feel like for some of you, Virgo, one person who is holding grudges towards you is someone you have rejected or they have rejected you. It feels like also that energy of if they are the ones who have rejected you, they did that because they want to take revenge, okay? And for some of you, if you the one who rejected them, and obviously they're holding grudges towards you because you rejected them. We've also got the hangman right here. I feel like um, there's one person here, possibly the same one, feeling, holding grudges towards you because they feel like they have made a lot of uh, sacrifices for you. They've done a lot of things for you in the past, Six of Cups. So that energy of you, like they may feel like they made the wrong judgment call helping you or were there for you. Um, but maybe you were, they, you were showing like you were ungrateful or that they think you're ungrateful. But Virgo, you know, we all, they said, they, they always say that there are two sides of a story. I don't believe that. I believe there are like three, four sides of a story. Um, because um, I still remember when I got into a fight in a club. I've never gotten in a fight before ever, but that was one time. Um, this girl pushed me, and uh, she was she was attacking me. Okay. Um, apparently, we. I, I think I've told that story before. We kind of like walk past each other. I didn't even realize or notice she was there at all. You know, in a club, a lot of people and you will bump into people and it's common, it's normal, nothing to be upset about. But she got really upset and everything was actually caught on CCTV and I was proven not guilty, okay, <laughs> because I was only defending myself. But uh, prior to that, prior to the CCTV being uh, 
confiscated by the police. She was spreading all kinds of rumors on social media saying that I took off my heels and then I beat her up, I beat her, like as if I was like in some Kung Fu movie, you know. <laughs> but um, that's not the truth. And for me, that was my truth, what I saw in my own eyes, what I remember. That, and that was her twisted uh, truth. And then there's the truth from the CCTV. So, but in any case, Virgo, so I'm not citing anybody here, okay? Whether you did wrong or they did wrong, but this is their truth, okay? How about that? So, but anyway, I didn't, I didn't go to jail or anything because the CCTV proved that I was only defending myself. And I did not, did not take, take off my heels and use my heels to beat anybody. I took off my heels to leave it on the side because she asked two other girls to come and get me, to beat me. And I was like, hey, you know what? I got two girls coming and I, need to, I could see them coming. They were already screaming and yelling at me. I took off my heels because I, I was wearing like five inch high heels. How am I supposed to balance myself, right? I took it off so I could balance myself. But you know, the reason why they all thought I was the bad one was because I didn't get hurt. All three of them got hurt by me single-handedly. Um, just by pulling their hair. But I pulled their hair like super hard. So um, everybody was shocked. Like, how can this, this girl doesn't look strong at all, but she's strong. But in any case, Virgo, what I'm trying to say is that this is this person's truth, okay? This person's truth is that you are being ungrateful. They have made a lot of sacrifices for you, okay? Six of Cups, they've helped you. They have, you know, been there for you. All of that good stuff in their mind, okay? Eight of Wands, Three of Wands. It does look like Virgo. This person, although, is holding grudges towards you, but I feel like deep down they want to see you. Deep down, they long for you. Deep down, they want to talk to you, but they just don't think it's such a good idea to do so with a judgment in one first. Could also be them like wanting this person, wanting to hash things out with you, okay? Now, the knight and the page could belong to the same person. So, again, could be a fire sign or a water sign. I feel like this person may have loved you, may have adored you at one point in time, it feels like things have turned sour between you and this person, okay? And then the Ace of Pentacles is right here. Yeah, they felt like they've contributed a lot in your life in some way, shape, or form. And Virgo, please bear in mind, it could go vice versa. It could also be somebody, what I'm seeing here is somebody you have contributed a lot in your life. You have helped them, sacrifice a lot for them, but yet they still hold certain grudges grudges towards you, you know? The, have you met those kind of people? I've met those kind of people uh, many times in my life. You've done so much for them, and then they turn around, point their finger back at you saying, oh, no, but blah, blah, blah. It's like they become the victim instead. For some of you, I do sense a bit of that feeling. Uh, it, could be, it could be they were the ones. I mean, you were the ones who have treated them well, but then they're still like, unhappy, holding grudges towards you, <laughs> okay? Death here, in any case, there's a separation between the two of you. And we've got the King of Swords, and then we've got Six of Pentacles, and we first, the Moon, and we first. You've also got a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Individual here could belong to the same person. See, not an equal give and take. So for some reason, this person feels like they've done things for you or being nice to you, kind to you. But, you know, um, they feel like as though you didn't reciprocate, you either rejected them or... And also another thing I'm picking up on here, judgment robbers, they feel like you were either being too judgmental towards them or you judged them incorrectly. Now the three of wands sometimes also can indicate maybe this person is um, at a distance from you are. If it's not that, it could just mean that Actually, this person um, 
longs to be reconnected with you for some reason. It's like that energy of love and hate. I hope that makes sense. The moon in reverse, maybe because something was being revealed, true colors or secrets, whatever it could be. Hmm. And another thing I'm picking up on here, Virgo, there is this, uh, sometimes the moon can indicate gossip. You may have one other person here, um, and I've experienced that before as well, where, for example, I remember being, being accused for saying something about some other girl where I had no idea at all about those information to begin with, or to have said anything about that girl. But you know, there is like that other, like um, people who just want to get you into trouble and point a finger at you and accuse you. For some of you, it's that person that somebody may have accused you of, of doing bad things to that person or gossip about that person. Because Moon here again, can they kick gossip? All right, Virgo, this is your reading. I hope you resonated in some way, shape or form. If you did, please hit like, share and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, my information is in the description box below. Feel free to subscribe to all of my other channels. All the links are in the description box below as well. And for those of you, if you like to book me for a personal reading, that is very accurate, which um, a lot of people tell me that. You can book me. Um, again, all info are in the description box below. Take care, Virgo. Love you guys. Bye.